Hello, my name is Ryan Travis. I'm with a company called Knight Services. Today we're going to be going over how to assess and properly document a loss location to determine whether there is or is not damage from a storm related event. One of the first photos for the technician is the loss address photo, just to identify that we are at the correct location. Next photo that the technician is gonna move into is your front risk. This is an overview of the front of the property of in, in its entirety. Not only shows the uh, exterior elevational wall, but also the roofing system itself and the layout of that property. The very next photo that the technician should move into would be a front elevational shot. It's essentially trying to capture any kind of damages to any components on that elevational wall, your window treatments, um, downspouts, any kind of wraps or any kind of aesthetics that we can document either collateral or spatter to the property. This also helps to identify storm, storm direction and a technician has wrote front elevation to observe damage to screening. Next photo is also on the front elevation. Technician is a set assessing the six inch downspout uh, it's going to label that as front elevation as well. No observed damage to downspout and or no observed spatter. Sometimes it's okay to identify the size and or if it is factory paint or, uh, or if it's been painted. Next photo looks like a contractor's in the corner of the photo, but the technician is moving to the right wrist, once again, to show the property of in, in its entirety, um, the layout of the right wrist, the overview. Overview of the property. Once again, your very next photo, you wanna move into your right elevational wall, find uh, one of the components. It can be a guttering system like that, that's lower ground, ground level. You can see any kind of impressions um, and protruding in the inside lip that will show you a directional side or the downspout itself to identify if there's any kind of collateral or spatter to that downspout. Okay, so the technician here is, is essentially showing the size of the downspout um, and possibly that it's factory paint. Okay, yep. Yeah. Next photo is going to be any of your meter mask. Once again, some of your components that are on the exterior wall. Um, looks like he, he checked out the meter mask and no observed spatter. Also checking out the HVAC system. Um, it should not only be that, that there's spatter or there's collateral damage from hail on ones that's got the metal casing like that. It takes fairly good size hail to damage those, but it could also be wind blown debris, any kind of tree fall, anything that has damaged that unit um, that needs to be documented. Photo report apps like this are, are very good um, to, you know, document the property and you don't have to pull photos from a camera and put them over into some type of uh, platform or application. You can essentially document um, on the fly. This photo looks like it is the rear wrist photo. Once again, showing the property in its entirety, not only the exterior wall, but also the roofing system as well. All of the photos that show the overview of the property are generally called wrist shots. You're gonna have a front risk, right risk, rear risk, and left wrist shot. Once again, after you take that big overview of your risk, you're gonna move into your elevation, find some, uh, some type of component, and you just found another downspout and he's going to identify that there is no damage to that downspout. And it's not, it's, it's important to know that you're not only identifying 
um, storm related damages, but you can also identify any kind of mechanical damages uh, from you know people weeding around that component, the, the base of it, um, a lawnmower, you know, children playing in the yard, throwing things against the wall, any kind of damage to that downspout. Took one photo of the rear risk elevation and has moved right into the left wrist shot. So once again, this is an overview of the property in, in its entirety. And once again, moving up to the elevation. Looks like the technician is trying to capture an image to show not only the HVAC, but also to show um, the uh, the slats on the deck. Once again, this will help you depict whether or not there's a spatter to the property, essentially a hailstone that hits um, and removes oxidation. So it removes essentially dirt, grime, algae, uh, and, 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 and cleans that surface area. And that's what he's labeling here, no observed damage and or spatter to the HVAC and I would say deck as well. Yep, yep, okay. And after that, you've basically documented your exterior elevations and it's time to move to your roofing system. Technician is uh, documenting his point of access to the roofing system and uh, where he'll be going up. It's also good sometimes the technician goes up the ladder and looks on that front gable to see if there's any damage.